Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I'm John. This is Many a True Nerd, and welcome to LA Noir, our new series on Saturday. So, before I get into this, let me just quickly explain what I'm going to be doing here. So, this whole idea of what I'm doing on Saturday now came out of Why Not Wednesday, which is, for those of you who have never seen it, Why Not Wednesday is my series where every other Wednesday, or thereabouts, I look at a game I know very little about and just kind of, in a single episode, try and get to grips whether I think it's good or not, whether it's worth picking up, because it'll be really cheap in bargain bins right now. But that caused me a problem. Because there's a fair few games from the last generation, which I never just never got around to playing for whatever reason, but I know a bit about them, and I think they're interesting enough to deserve to be looked at in more detail than a single episode of Why Not Wednesday. So what I'm going to be doing on Saturday from now on is I'm going to be looking at a game that I think is interesting, that I've not played before, but I know a little bit about, but I think it's worth having dedicating at least a few parts to it. And if I like it, it becomes a full series. I keep doing it until the game is done. And if I don't like it, or if you don't like it, then it gets scrapped after a few parts, and we try a different thing, we move on to another game and another series. Blood Noir Noir is a fascinating game, I just never played, I don't know why, because it's detective and driving and shooting and LA Confidential, which I don't actually remember anything about, but I remember it being an okay movie, so apparently this is like that, but, but interactive, because it's a game. Anyway, let's play LA Noir. A city on the verge of greatness. A new type of city, based not on the man, but on the automobile, the car. The so it's a game about cars, alright? Where every man can own his own home. Oh, she's gonna be dead in ten minutes. <laughs> she doesn't stand a bloody chance. She was, She's happy and lives in a nice house and gave me a kiss on the cheek. Did I just say Hollywoodland? Is that what the Hollywood sign used to say? Yeah, I don't know. I've been to Los Angeles, I've seen the Hollywood sign a few times, but uh, I've actually worked in Los Angeles, in fact. But uh, I, I didn't realise it used to be different if it did. A city, a city of undercurrents. Where not everything is as it seems. They've just been talking about Los Angeles being an upcoming city for about four minutes now. I kind of get it. Los Angeles, city, America, on the up. In the Marine Corps, you deal with the chain of command. Mistakes get made, but you deal with them. You know what you're fighting for, and that you're on the same team. Okay, so I'm a, I'm a Marine, am I? Am I a Marine? You never know whether the guy you're talking to is on the pad. What's on the pad mean? Is that good or bad? Is my partner asking me who I trust? I should probably tell him him, although I'll probably don't. I've no idea who he is. In fact, the fact I just heard that speech means that guy next to me, he's probably not on the level or on the pad. Because I can speak 1940s of Los Angeles now. Oh, put me in charge. Oh, I'm in a, I'm in a fancy car. I am in a fancy car. Oh, I like this. Missy, well, I guess it was going to be 1940s cars, John. It is 1940s. Ooh, but still, that's rather nice, isn't it? Okay. So, it's pretty standard driving mechanics. We can get next right. All right. Uh, ooh, fly me! Okay. Sorry. That, that, wow. Okay, the cars handle, the cars actually handle really quite sharply. They're not swervy at all. Ooh, motivated crime scene. Excellent. There is a crime scene. Here is a bald man. We have the Vic, Scooter Payton, a Negro male bagged up and on his way to Central Morgue. Witness says a tall white guy, our shooter, put two in the Vic's head and then threw his piece. I need you guys to try and recover the gat. Reco guys. Recover the gat? Is that the gun? Does that mean the gun? Oh, oh god, can we have translations? I just want, I don't want sub, I don't just want subtitles, I want a translation too. Floyd, we got places to be. Happy hunting. If I didn't know better, I'd suggest those two gentlemen in the police weren't actually that bothered by the dead black male. Dear, oh dear. Wait, hang on, what am I holding? Oh, I've got a, I have got a weird sideways torch. I've got a, oh, is this, is this what torches were like in the 1940s? It's not my job to pick through other people's trash. Yes, it is. You're a crime scene investigator. That's exactly what your job is. That's literally your job. Okay, so vibration lets me know what I'm supposed to be looking at. Use L to select an object. Okay, so you vi when the controller vibrates and close by to something, then you can have a look at that something and you can pick it up. And this is a bottle. So the newspapers may have backstory that is relevant to my case. So the mind is the final frontier, says this doctor in this newspaper. 
and the victim was a black male shot twice in the head, where the mind is located, the shooter was a white male, like this doc- The doctor did it! Okay, good. Okay, we have our suspect. It was the doctor. The doctor who did it, because he was trying to investigate the final frontier that is the mind. And he decided to do it by actually getting access to a mind, but he was in a hurry. So the only way he could get access to the mind was to blow the head open of someone else relatively quickly. So that would, yes, that would make sense. This all would make sense. Now, have we got any more vibration? I felt a vibration. What was it? Come on, am I supposed to be examining something over here? Yes, I found a thing. Is that a paintbrush? No, 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 not no good to you. Take a look at it. I think it's a, a chisel, a chisel or a paintbrush. Oh, another thing. Optimistic call. Is that a cigarette butt? Oh, this is the torch line. This is the torch line. You're not allowed to torch beyond this point. Oh, what's? Aha! The gun. Something on the rooftop. But wait, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. He he asked me to look at this door first. Yes, we should look at the blood splatter, because. When a human head is exploded, it produces blood, because the head, like most humans, is full of blood. So, this would have been where his head went pop. Well, they're wrong, whatever they think, because I've already got a prime suspect. It was the psychologist who was trying to examine the human mind. He was just in a hurry this evening. Oh, oh, oh. Not sure this means much. Well, it potentially means the killer was a smoker. If that cigarette was left there relatively recently, that would mean that would give us good evidence that the, uh... That would potentially give us evidence that the person was a smoker. That the killer was a smoker. That could be really useful. Come on, Cole. Fuck your ideas up. Oh, I am. Damn action cop. I walk quite slowly. But, uh, for some mysterious reason, I, I climb drain pipes like I am Spider-Man. Or Spider-Cop, I suppose. Okay, what's going on over here? This will be the gun. This will presumably be something relevant. Smith and Wesson, serial S71893. I feel like I should really be wearing gloves or something here. Two rounds fired. Wait, how did he know two? Oh, is that what those little holes in the the bottom left are there? Um, those are that means a bullet's been fired. I okay. You know, for some reason, I would always have assumed that if two bullets have been fired, that would mean that there will be two black holes where there wasn't any of that gold circle, but then I don't know what a gun is or how it works, so that's fine. Okay, so having put our fingerprints all over the murder weapon, let's, uh, let's be on our way, I guess. It's a pretty fancy gun. You know a local gun store? Sure. There's a place a couple of blocks from here. Ooh, I like the notebook. The notebook's great. Oh, that's really cool. I've got a little pencil. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's really cool. Oh, this is... Oh, that's really cool. I like that. I like that. So I get to review all of the evidence, though. <laughs> I don't actually know anything about the uh, the victim or anything. So once you've got a location, you set it in your notebook. Sure hey, wasn't there another car over here? I'm going for this car. There seemed to be another car right here. Bye! <laughs> Oh dear, where's he got? Where is he? Is he actually going to try and follow me? Where's my partner? Is he already done? Done where are you? Where are you gone? Oh, good dodge. Good dodge, man. Question is, can you keep it up, cop? No time to stop. Oh, no, you can't. Okay, best two out of three. Oh, oh, a good dodge. Okay, we've got a good game here. Okay, so he's he's dodged two and been hit once. Ooh, okay, which way am I going to go? I'm going to go... Oh, wow, he is good. Three... Okay, he's three one up. Okay, and he's going to go this way. He is really... D oh, got him that time, though. Oh, that's four to two. That is four to two. And... He's got to go this way. Yes! I don't feel bad about doing this because I'm pretty confident he's going to be a traitor because... Oh, yes, I'm pretty sure. Now let's park on top of him. Now, let's go find this gun store. Let's go find a gun store. Because apparently we've decided to be... I assume what was meant is... So Cole's looking for promotion, I guess? 
He wants to be, like, promoted or something? Is that what he wants? I guess so. He kind of wants to be promoted so he doesn't have to do, like, this day-to-day -day cop stuff anymore. He just like, wants to work in, like, the back office. Or maybe he wants to be a detective. He wants to be like those two guys who didn't give a damn and just walked away without bothering to do anything earlier. Can I cut through here to get to the... No, no, definitely cannot. Okay, never mind. Oh, oh, sorry! 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 Oh, blimey, it would be unfortunate. <laughs> so we're putting in overtime to try and uh, solve this murder. I think I've killed at least one person so far. On my, on my extra little jaunt to try and solve the murder. So, um, okay. Oops. You literally swerved into me! I'm sorry, sir. Police officer. Your ain't your got, you know. Huh. Okay. Oh, so I've just unlocked a car. I've just unlocked a car by going into it. Okay. Well, I'll be having this car. Sir, I'm going to car, please. LAPD. Step out of the car, please. Will I be having your car? Are we going to look getting around in this thing, Cole? That's fine. We won't go in this thing. I just want to unlock all the cars. Oh, open top car, though. Oh, come on. This feels like a pretty good car. This feels like a pretty good car. Oh, I feel like they're going to respect us way more if we go around like this. I was enjoying this car. I hope you get the death penalty. Oh, you're not happy, are you? You're not happy with your treatment. Uh, excuse me? LAPD, police emergency. Step out of the car, please, sir. I think you'll find this is our car now. Thank you. Boss! 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 Get out of the damn way. No, shut up. I need this bus. Excuse me? Excuse me? Give me the damn bus. I want this bus. I want this bus. Give me the bus. Oh, why can't I have the bus? I can have everything else. Why not the bus? No, this is somehow not fair. Oh, fine. Okay. So I've helped myself to all of these cars. You know, we're, we're going to the gun store in style. We are going to the gun store in style. Oh, where's my partner? Oh, he's not here. Oh, so long, loser. Yeah, bro, why don't you just bring the police car along with you when you get here? Central guns. We sell ammo. That's good, because it would be kind of weird if you didn't. Gold-handled doors allow entrance. Officers Phelps and Dunn. So if you're a criminal in Los Angeles, just have a silver-handled door, and you will be completely safe. These babies are only available special order. Here's my Smith & Wesson order book. You mind if I take a look? Be my guest. Okay, so the nice gun shop owner has given us a thing. Oh, blimey, hello. Oh, 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 oh. That's 27, but no, that's not right. Okay, where's 27 with a pearl grip? Yes, that's the one. Look. We're in luck. Errol Schroeder, 203 South Glass Street. Ordered the gun in February 46. Can't remember when this game said. I'd love to think that it was in 1942. There's about to be some sort of massive time travel twist. Oh, hello. Thing? Ooh, I get to examine ducks. Hmm. Ducks, you say? Not going yet. I'm having a looksy round. I'm having a looksy round in case there's something going on here. Because there might be more. This guy was actually a little bit too suspiciously helpful. So I just want to have a look around in case there's more... There could be more going on here. More than, ooh, more than meets the eye. Okay, you're in the clear for now. But I'm, I'm suspicious that the moment I'm gone, you're going to be calling this guy. I'm, I'm concerned. Let's see if he's at home. Owning the gun doesn't prove he pulled the trigger. Okay. In for a penny, in for a pound. Bye. <laughs> it's quite impressive how sharply these cars can turn. So, uh, don't really... Sorry! If anyone asks, I, I... Officially, I don't own this car, so there's no way they can pin this on me. There's no way they can pin this one on me. Oh, you see, there's much less traffic on the pavement. My partner's still on the map. He, he's somewhere. I think he hasn't managed to figure out that he ought to get a new car yet. Come on. Come on, just let me pass. Ooh, nice. Oh! Didn't quite get that one, though. I think I might have murdered this guy. And also, I think my own car's not, not great. Excuse me, sir. You okay? I oh, know he's alive. 
He's totally alive. He is fine. Sir, get out of the car. Be please. careful with it, copper. Get out of the way. There's crime. Okay, Schroeder's apartment. It's now half eleven, and my partner's magically caught up to me. So that's a silver door. So that means I can't. I can't go in here. Which is particularly a shame because I think I'm the model in the window. I actually think I'm the model in this window, but sadly I'm not allowed to go in, even though it would allow me to get a fancier hat. Inspect the mailboxes. Okay. I'm after Schroeder apartment two. I like how you actually have to do these little these little moments of investigation. The game just doesn't like give you a map and you know put the little tick on it that you'll just lead you to apartment two. It does actually, you know, force you to kind of look at... Ooh, I like this apartment. That, that, that's a well-armoured apartment right there. Okay. Why do we get the feeling that this is going to end in some sort of chase? Some sort of got? drama? You'll be surprised to know that Scooter Payton was murdered tonight with your gun. You're out of your mind. Scooter, he works for me. I have that gun here in my drawer. Oh, dear. Okay. Okay, so I'm assuming he's actually what innocent. What's going on here? You're under arrest, Schroeder. Cuff him, Ralph. No way. You're not taking me down for this. What? Yeah, why on earth would you think that this was the best solution? Ooh, I'm going to block. Ooh, punch him. Punch him in the groin. Punch him in the groin. Block. Block. Ooh, yes. Ooh. Oh. Oh, he knocked. You knocked my hat off. Oh, you. Right, you're going down. Ralph. You all right? I'm fine. I hardly felt it. He's lucky he caught me off guard. I want my hat back. Keep an eye on him, Ralph. I want my hat. Yeah, yeah we go. Quite right, too. If this guy's guilty, would you really have gone over to the drawer to show it being... Uh, I guess it could be play acting. That could have all just been play acting, wouldn't it? That would make sense. Right, let's have a look, see what we got here. I'm guessing not IP addresses, because it's 1946. List of names and a series of numbers. Floyd Rose's name is in this book. Ooh, the investigator. It's all bright and shiny with a commendation. Or stick our schlongs in a hornet's nest. Call it in, partner. And leave the book where you found it. Oh, do I get to investigate more? Oh, is that might be the end? Is that the end of the case? Oh, I'm having a dream about a train. <laughs> Or a tram. Am I? Or maybe I have psychic visions. Oh, my psychic cop. Is that young Cole? Is that young Cole Phelps? Wait, I was a marine. Wait, I think I was a marine. The voiceover that being engaged in something about marines. So it's the three fucking stooges, and you're here for OCS. God help this fucking country in the USMC. Oh, please stop using acronyms I've never heard before. OCS. Octopus. Octopus Capturing Society? The people who were responsible for capturing the octopuses that were instrumental in the US war effort against the Japanese? Yeah, I'm gonna go for that. Okay, so we're into a- is this a new case? Is this a new case? Oh, there's a shootout we're getting involved in. Okay, armed and dangerous. Now, okay, so we've done some investigation, and now we're learning how to do a- oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Wait a second here. We might want a better car first. Any of you fine gentlemen got a nice sports car? No, I don't like your cars. That's fine. I'm glad that someone's repaired our car in the meantime. That is very nice indeed. Civilians in Los Angeles are twitchy. I'll give them the reason to. We'll give them reason to be twitchy. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Can we fit through here? Oh, we can totally fit through here. Yeah, you better damn run. You better run. Are you trying to run people over? Yes, I'd say that's pretty obvious. Now let's just. Uh, got things to do. We do, but look, we've got a suitcase. Can we get the suit? Oh, we can't get his briefcase. Mm, that's a shame. If that had been full of drugs, you'd have been thrilled that I'd just done that. I would have been a goddamn hero. Can I go upstairs? Yes, I... Oh. Yes, I can. This is great. It's magnificent being a cop. Also, screw you, city infrastructure. Oh, I wouldn't go this way, though. Oh, oh, no. People with guns. <laughs> Oh dear, this was a bit aggressive. We better get some guns here. Oh, I've got a shotgun. Oh, that's way better than your gun. That's way better than your gun. I feel like I'm not in good cover here. Do you want to pop up? Oh, ho, ho, that's nice. That was nice. Now let's stay in cover. I'm really not good at cover. Ooh, 
Lock on system and a satisfying shotgun. That is good. Where are the bad guys? Oh, there's one of oh there's one up there. Okay. Ooh. Oh, oh ho! Oh, he was full of jam. It's okay, Ralph. You did well in there. I'm glad you had my back. Man couldn't ask for a better partner. Oh, my guy's lovely. Oh, Cole, you're a nice man. You're such a nice man. Okay. Oh, okay, we're into another flashback already. Oh, that was a really short mission next to the first one. All right. So I'm learning how to be an octopus capturer. Okay, so I was an officer. Oh, maybe that's what O actually stands for. Officer. Officer something. Okay, so I was I was some sort of leader in the war, but I'm guessing it didn't go spectacularly. I know that bomb. Window Bowers. Get after him, Phelps. I'll head him off in the car. We could just both be in the Oh, we could just both be in the car. Am I even Oh, yes, yes, okay, I am actually. I am actually doing something. Okay. Okay, so we're right into the third mission where now we're learning about pursuit, run towards an obstacle to vault it automatically. Oh, hello! No, 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 don't run me over. And then I seem to be catching up to this guy pretty darn quickly. So, I don't know, maybe we'll do... Oh, move towards the ladder to climb it. There we are, we'll just follow him. Where on earth are you planning to go from here? What on earth is your plan at this point? Yeah, you can you can keep going up, but eventually you're gonna have to come down again. I feel like ah oh blimey, I could have just grabbed his. I really should have just grabbed his leg then. What is your plan, you lunatic? All right, so we're doing a pursuit thing now, which I'm assuming is another thing that we need to learn about. But what on earth are you planning to do next? Okay, we're gonna go across here. You've not done your time. You skipped parole. I don't know exactly what that means, but it sounds bad, and the cop said it was bad, so we're just gonna run with this. Okay, run towards a gap to go by it. He just wants to run across the things, does he? Okay, we're just doing a... Oh, boy! He clotheslined me quite nicely there. Okay, I'm, I'm okay. Oh, oi, 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 oi. Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Okay, remember. Remember how to do this. Remember how to do this. When he swings in, dodge. Oh, yep, and now we are going to punch you in the face a bit. He got a good clothesline on me, though. He got a good clothesline on me. And we're into, yeah, wow, well, we're going through the flashbacks quickly here. Leadership, Donahoe, eight, Franklin, seven, Merrill, six, Kowalski, six, Weiss, five, Hudson, five, Kelso, one. Oh, am I ranking people? Okay, so there's a bloke called Kelso, who was also potentially an officer in the war, but he wasn't keen on making tough decisions that got people killed, but I was, and that was apparently what I was supposed to be doing. Okay. Why do we think Kelso is going to be a bad guy in this game? This could be the one call. Oh, apparently this is my big, this could be the big act one moment. So here we are. Apparently this is going to be my big moment. My big moment to shine is going to be solving this crime because I was first on the scene. This is going to make me a rising star in the LAPD. And we'll do that next time, I think. We'll do that next time. So, yes. This has been that anyway. I've enjoyed this. I enjoy the detection. I think the shooting mechanics feel pretty solid. The cars feel quite nice to drive. They're pretty. And the 40s aesthetic makes it, you know, really stand out from GTA and Saints Row and Watch Dogs, which is nice because it's, uh, it's lovely retro cars rather than kind of the cars. And that all kind of were very, very similar, apart from Saints Row 4, where the cars were just ridiculous. But never mind. Um, oh, yes. This has been... This has been quite enjoyable. I've enjoyed this and there'll be a fair few more parts. But let me know. Let me know how much you kind of enjoyed L.A. Noire and how much you want to see more of L.A. Noire. Because this, as I said at the beginning, this series is totally up for grabs. If you want to, like, do more of this, if you want to see more of this series, let me know there will be more of this series. If you want me to kind of move on relatively quickly to something else, let me know and we will move on relatively quickly to something else. But I'll tell you what, I've been enjoying this and I really want to give this a bit more of a look. So, uh, yeah, there we are. L.A. Noire. Enjoyable. This was always one I was never quite sure why I made time from where it first came out. But uh, I'm making time for it now, and that's the important thing. So, uh, yeah. So next week, bit more L.A. Noire. And in the meantime, I've been John. This has been Many a True Nerd. And this has been L.A. Noire. Thank you very much, and goodbye.